Happy New Year's Eve. You guys will want to challenge you with something this New Year's Eve instead of making New Year's resolutions, instead of making this long list of things that you probably won't ever do or maybe will do for a week or two, instead of doing those things, why not pursue the Lord in prayer and fasting and find out what He wants you to do this year coming up 2023 because I can tell you this his plans for you are good Jeremiah 29 11 I know the plans I have for you says the Lord plans for a future not to harm you he has good plans for you his plans involve you denying yourself and your desires and that's why I want to challenge you to put down your desires Put down all the things that you think would be best to do. And instead, ask God, what do you want my life to look like this next year? How can I be of use for your kingdom in 2023? Because if God knows the plans that he has for you, he already knows what 2023 is supposed to look like for you. He knows the things that he wants you to do. So I'm challenging you to step out of your comfort zone. <laughs> Prayer, fasting, humble yourself before the Lord and ask him what it is that he would have you to do in this upcoming season. Instead of going out partying, getting drunk, doing all the things that everyone else is gonna do, driving home with who knows who, waking up naked with who knows who. I'm just saying, <laughs> life is so short. And if we are going to be children of God, we have got to be holy and righteous before him. The only way to be holy and righteous before him is to deny our own selfish desires. Are you willing to do that? right now for this next year in order to position yourself to have the best year that you've ever had. Why do I say it would be the best? Because you are placing yourself off of the altar or on the altar and off of the throne. You're placing God on the throne and you're saying, I surrender God. I surrender. I don't want to keep driving. I don't want to keep being the Lord of my life. And watch what he'll do. Send me your testimonies of what God is doing for 2023. What is he saying to you? What is he challenging you with? You know, personally, I want to stay up late and pray. Pray in the new year. And I hope that you'll do the same. And I can't wait for the testimonies to start flooding in. I know God's already has them prepared. And he wants us to uh, lay down the things that we've been holding on to. Whether it's pride, selfishness, jealousy, envy, contention. Like whatever it is. There's always something in us that needs to be rooted out. So are you willing to lay those things down? so that you can live in freedom in 2023? I hope you are. I hope you have the best New Year's start that could possibly happen for you. I decree and declare that 2023 is going to be a year of breakthrough for you. All you have to do is position yourself. And I'll see you on my next video.